you guys okay i'm working my way through the sections i have my alarm set it has been 20 minutes and i'm trying to get this on and done so i can get it in a bag and process it i have worked the back sections saturated them with 20 volume and let those suckers get the processing because they were the darkest and now i'm about to work my way to the top i'll check back okay you guys right now i'm about to tone I've washed the very, very fine yellow. Yes, it still has some of the stubborn orangey stuff. You know, in the back, this back is very hard to get through. I have like, you know, I haven't perfected my technique yet. I'm getting it on, but it is pretty, pretty bright. So I'm hoping the T18 will go well. There's still some of that where I ran out of product. And it's you see it, it's just, and it started drying up. And it's just not easy being a novice, you know? But I'm gonna have to just be happy with whatever results I get this time because I'm out of money. And my hair, I'm just not going to put it through any more processes for a while. So, I will work on that stuff in the bag at a later time. Right now, I'm just trying to get it kind of combed out, brushed out lightly. Um, I was hoping to get rid of, you know, the more dark blonde pieces, but I'll just have to live with it. At least it's not what it was. I don't I'm going to put the toner in here in a minute, but I'm probably not, because of the fact that damn developer is toning volume, and it's a permanent toner, I'm probably not going to leave it on very long. It's probably going to start darkening my hair. See that shit? I hate that. I fucking hate that. And I just didn't saturate enough. You know, I concentrated so heavily on the back. I'm used to this process when I used to go to my hairdresser. You know, sometimes it would take us two or three times to get it, two or three visits to get it to a shade. But I've worked hard to get it bright, you know, up high enough, and I just hope that toner doesn't darken it up a whole hell of a lot. It probably will in certain spots, but yeah, I want to be able to pull it up in a ponytail and not have that shit. That is what I was trying to get rid of. And I think by the time I got around to the front this time, it just, um... My product was about gone. My 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 batter, <laughs> it was about gone, you know, and probably should have mixed up more, saturated it. I just knew that shit was going to come up. But that's where I'm at. I'm just going to have to deal. And I'm going to make a third video at some point. Totally going over all of this stuff. Um... The processes and everything I did and um, I made a mistake in one video I posted and I talked about the color wheel and what cancels what again I'm not a professional and I'm still learning and retaining that kind of knowledge color that color specialists have and color theory and all that um, today I know that t18 is a high level 10 toner and it's violet based I thought it was blue based this Ion V, 9V, that I used on the first round is also violet-based. Blue is the one that cancels orange. More blue. And I haven't used any toners. I thought the last round, I thought I was mixing ash. I thought ash was blue-based. Because it's cooler. I don't know. There's so much that you have to get straight and remember. But it's not. It's violet-based. So both of these are basically violet. I don't know what mixing them would get me. They violet cancels yellow. It cancels the more hideous yellow tones and brings them to a nicer shade. But depending if I want to be ashy or if I want to be more warm, that's the kind of stuff that I really need to start retaining the knowledge and get better at. So I guess I'm just going to go in with the T18. I could put some of this in it too, but I don't think they have different. This one says ash blonde and this one says cool blonde. I think that's about the same thing. 
and I wouldn't want to overdo the ashiness, you know. So I guess I'm just going to mix up that T18 and I'm only going to leave it on there a little bit. I'm scared, y'all. I'm scared. Let's see what we come out with. Okay. Show. I just wanted to show y'all before I do it. All right. I'm going to go tone it. I'm going to get that toner in and then rinsed out and I'll show y'all the results. Okay, the toner is on the T18 from that very bright shit I had and it's going fast. So I don't even know how long I want to leave this on here. I'm starting to get worried. Like, because I do not want it to take my bright. I'd rather have some fucking yellow than it go back dark. I'll be pissed. I'm going to take a strip of hair out and look at it. See how fast it gets to that tone? I'm, no way, I'm leaving it on here 30 minutes. Nope. Even if I have to end up toning it again at some point. It's only been on here fucking less than 10 minutes. I told you all that shit starts going fast when you're at a certain bright yellow level. Ugh. at a real pale yellow level t18 eats good the, the, it just eats it just tones i mean and i told y'all i was scared because i was scared it was going dark and dark. i don't know i still don't know what the final outcome is going to be this is me with having rinsed it out i've already washed all the toner out y'all saw me panicking i got that shit out in 10 minutes did not wait the full 20 but uh, i know better than that all right this is me it's looking kind of dark in the back kind of grayish in some parts of the back but this is me after washing rinsing and i've got conditioner thick up in it right this minute and we're gonna see Ugh, look at that now that is not nice that is the back underneath those fucking stubborn spots I told y'all about. But I'm just hoping and praying it's going to come out decent enough to live with for a while. Right now, it looks like a pretty cool ashy blonde, but I don't want gray shit. I don't mind a cool, like, mellow blonde. Like, you know, it don't have to be. I don't fucking know. All right, I'm going to rinse the conditioner out, and then I will show y'all the results, and then I will let it dry, and then I'm going to, well, I mean, I'm going to, after I show y'all those results, after this conditioner, I'm going to put it in my mask, and the shit's all black, and about 30 minutes, and I'm falling fast, and I remember life before you, that's fast, I feel good, you look great, I like you, I can't wait, a first time, a first day, you're so fine, I'm so late, you sip wine, I drink straight, don't waste time, to my place, I feel my heart erase, so catch me if I fall. 